Hi everyone and welcome to Teach Me Tuesday. My name is Dana Jalkinen and I'm the Deputy Director of Museum and Education here at the Ohio State House. Um, and today we're standing in front of the portrait of Governor John Kasich. Um, John Kasich was Governor of Ohio from January of 2011 through January of 2019. So this is the most recent portrait that was added to the collection of governor's portraits that we have here at the Ohio State House. Uh, the painting was completed by the artist John Walker in the spring of 2019, and it was hung last December, um, so December of 2019. However, because oil paint takes so long to dry, it couldn't be um, given its varnish until just a couple of weeks ago. So um, the artist stopped by the Ohio State House and um, was kind enough to share his insights and talk a little bit about the varnishing process. So we're going to share that with all of you today. So I hope you enjoy and thank you all so much for watching this video. So here, we're here with John Walker, who is working on putting a varnish on the portrait of Governor Kasich. Can you tell us a little bit why a, a varnish is so important to a portrait? Uh, yes, uh, this varnish is, uh, is intended to both kind of revitalize the painting and help it to look vibrant and the way it's intended to look uh, when it was being painted and was wet paint. But after about a year, the paint has dried and cured and becomes very matte and chalky. And so the varnish helps reestablish the look of the painting uh, is that I'm desiring it to have. But also the varnish is a, a protective coat that will keep the surface from collecting dust and being exposed to the elements. So this varnish will uh, Will mean to help maintain the archival quality of the painting, and this varnish is a synthetic varnish, uh, so it's non-yellowing. It has archival elements in it: UV, uh, sun, uh, harsh uh, UV blocking properties, and uh, it can be easily cleaned and easily removed. So uh, it will enhance the painting and protect it. Do you have any uh, fun facts about this portrait that you'd like to share? Uh, it's interesting. This painting was done, was staged, and the sitting was done outside at the Holocaust and Liberators Memorial here at the State House, uh, on the State House grounds. And it was a almost the winter solstice when we did the sitting. And I've uh, been working with Governor Kasich in his office. We were looking for opportunities, uh, conceptions, compositions for things to be staged inside. And he said, hey, how about we go outside and do something at the Holocaust Memorial? And uh, I was quick to learn that he had been a big advocate for the construction of the memorial and getting the funding and being able to have it be built. And so it meant quite a lot to him. So once we were outside doing our preliminary scouting around to see what we would uh, be able to come up with. It's quite a big memorial with the background vertical monument element as well as the long horizontal wall. So I found that I was able to stage the painting where I could get a piece of both and in staging on the vertical, I mean on the horizontal wall that area, I wanted him to be interacting with it and so I was able to get him to lean against it and to uh, strike a pose that with a little bit of artistic license and work I could balance elements of the composition with um, his, his engaging with the wall. I was also able to fortunately get a, I was looking for a piece of script that could show that there's much wording carved into the, into the wall and so I was able to get a piece of script that I thought was particularly um, poignant to save one life here. And with many of Governor Kasich's beliefs and sensibilities, the idea of, of compassion and preservation of human life, this became a very meaningful thing to have in this portrait. So uh, I ended up entitling the portrait, Save One Life, and also was able to scatter some of the fallen leaves into the background to help me both balance the composition but also I thought it kind of serves a metaphor for the fallen for those people who have been lost and 
uh, were no longer with us. So uh, it was a, a great experience for me and a wonderful opportunity working with Governor Kasich. I quite enjoyed his uh, company and uh, found myself very, very much uh, respectfully admiring him for my opportunity to get to know him.